Welcome to another day of Ireland's hot sauce reviews. Well, sitting here right now, I have five sauces from Mac Chili. Ewan has been updating his range and he's been sitting in his little laboratory dreaming up different flavours for everyone to try out from low heat to high heat. But before I start, uh, I'll show you what I have. I have five sauces all together. Um, somebody asked me, why don't I do more than one sauce at a time? Simple reason, right, is I like to give the company that I'm doing um, and the sauce that I'm doing a good crack at the whip. So I want to know what the heat's like. I want to know what the flavour is like. If I mix that with another sauce, right, the heat is already going to be in my mouth. The flavour from the other sauce is already going to be in my mouth. So I'm not going to get a true flavour from that sauce. So that's the reason that I only do one sauce at a time. Because I want to give it a, a good old taste test, as I would like to say. Right, just to let you know how I feel. Like this one here, right, has got peppermint and spearmint in it. Now, I did do that one at the weekend, and I followed that up with another sauce. I, told you, I tried something different, eating, putting it on food, right? What happened there was the peppermint, the spearmint, which in this one, took everything away from the sauce that followed it. And that's the reason, right, I had to go back and do that other sauce again because the flavour and the heat was already in my mouth from this one and it took it away from the next one. So that's kind of like the reason I'd only do the one sauce because I want to give a true verdict on a sauce on heat and flavour. And the only way you can do that is by doing one sauce at a time, okay? So that's the basically reason I want to do one sauce. So, that one out of the road, let me show you the five bottles that I have here. Now, I've already reviewed two of them, which is the Angel of Death and this one, which was the Soul Destroyer. Now, that has got the peppermint and spearmint in it. This one had an extract in it. So, if you like a fantastic burn, the Angel of Mercy was the, sorry, Angel of Death was the one for you. If you love peppermint and spearmint flavours, that Soul Destroyer was absolutely fantastic. I loved the flavours from it and the heat came in as well. It was lower down than the Angel of Death, but it suited me down to a T. So that was the first two that I've done. Sitting here right now, June has now come up with another three sauces right off his little production line in his little laboratory. So, what I have is the Satanic Scorpion. Now, when I do these sauces, I'll let you know better when it comes along. So, Satanic Scorpion. Follow up to the Angel of Death, you have the Angel of Mercy. This one does not have the extract in it which the Angel of Death has. So, this one here is an all natural sauce. Okay? But the one I'm going to do today is the Tequila Sunrise, I have to say. Those labels are absolutely fantastic. I love how they just come straight out. I love a company that just spends time, not only with the sauce, but the presentation of it as well. And that there is absolutely lovely. So, let's see what's in the mix here. Now, it does say Tequila Sunrise is a very fruity sauce with strawberries and plums along with red jalapeno and red habanero, giving it a medium heat. Now, it does say here, this one here is a 4 out of 10. This sauce screams ice cream, or any dessert, or, any, or but anything can, it can be used for anything, a dressing on a salad, or any dish that you wish for marinating as well. The ingredients list is red jalapeno, chili mash, sorry, uh, strawberries, red habanero chilies, red onions, plums, and balsamic, balsamic vinegar. Not a lot in there, as ingredients wise, but I'll tell you what, a lot of flavour. And I'm just looking at this sauce now, and it is a very drinkable one. I promise I won't do it. I'll try anyway, but you can see it there. So, let's get this one up and running. So as I say, this is the Chula Sunrise from Mac Chili. Heat level, variable. Now you can see it there. 
Right, that looks a good runny sauce anyway. I have to say, I love that colour. So let's see if I can get this first time. Yep. Miracles will never cease. But you're getting the peppers from it. I'm sure that's the strawberry. Hmm. Oh, it's a lovely smell. You're getting the onion. That could be the, the, the vinegar, the balsamic vinegar. Oh, so. Let's get it on the spoon. Big spoon, of course. So the pour, you can just see that just coming straight out. And yes, the good old spoon is full. Oh, it's got a right, you definitely get a fruitiness from this one. Oh, I love the smell of that. I love the look of it as well. My mouth's watering already. So, Mac Chili, your tequila sunrise. So you're going to tickle my little taste buds with flavour today. Lovely flavour to it. The heat obviously coming off of the, the habanero. A little bit of a sting. It's not even, it's just giving me a sting and no more. Remember, I always say to everybody, that's me, just remember that. When it comes to, oh, when it comes to a non chili head, at this moment in time, one with the ball. If you used to hide one, I'd be surprised. You're getting the strawberries, you're getting the plum. I like that. Definitely. A fruity sauce. I want to put that in ice cream. Some screaming out to me, mixing it in with ice cream. I actually making ice cream and mixing it through it. That's a cracking sauce. I'm going to leave the rest. I want to try that ice cream. Oh, that could be another review on its own. Heat still is very, very low. But when it comes to the flavours, all around my mouth, because I've got a light burn, I've actually more on my lips than I have my tongue. There you go. Uh, you're definitely getting that fruitiness from it. You're definitely picking the peppers up as well. You're getting that. I'll tell you what, that's a cracking sauce. 
strawberry and plum together is maybe a hard one to pick up but I was getting the fruitiness from it <coughs> excuse me you're getting onions as well I'll tell you what that is Ewan that must be a stare on your list keep that one because that is a definite winner for me there you go that's the first of the three but as I see, he brought five out all together um, brand new ones two have already done that one here is the lowest out of the five that I'm going to do um, the first two one had an extract one had the peppermint spearmint the other two are totally different I've not tried these ones yet but that one there is a way down in the heat level as I say, I've got a, I would probably say how much I've taken for a non chilli head you maybe hit a two I've got a lovely lovely burn in the tongue now but it's not even up there okay so when it comes to heat depending on where you are on the levels I would say a definite a definite two for a non chilli head there you go for us chilli heads that's gone in no time but I would more looking at flavour definitely get it all that fruitiness from the strawberries and the plums definitely getting onions definitely picking up the habanero pepper as well because I'm getting that little sting oh mac chilli your tequila sunrise definitely gave me my little fix for flavour today well done roll on to the next ones I'll see you all later Bye.